this is like a 12 year old boy's dream come true this village <laughs> why is you that you can go anywhere and explore yeah. you can walk up into people's bedrooms and houses on the roof wherever you want to go that's a perfect intro yeah <laughs> <laughs> hey guys how's it going matt from the Jaya nation you know this guy this is jim ni hao Jim and I have uh, explored some interesting, uh, interesting places and, and, and things in Ningbo and uh, in Chongqing. And today we're at a unique place. Jim found it. Tell us about this place, Jim. So it's pretty close to my house and we were just out walking, taking pictures one day and just kept walking and walking and walking and stumbled on this place. And then we've been back, we've probably been back here 10 times now taking photos. The University of Ningbo, Ningbo University, brings photo groups over here, photo classes to take photos, because there's nothing else like this that they've seen, mm. nothing like I've seen either. It's like urban archaeology, and it's you can go anywhere. Wow. And we're waiting for uh, Jim's friend, Barry. He's going to be uh, the third wheel on this little adventure. Basically, where we are, we're in the middle of Ningbo, and Ningbo is a very, very, is it, it's new tier one now, metropolis. And it's building, like you can see it around us, it's, it's, there's apartment complexes growing out of all corners. And we are actually in a valley of construction projects. In the middle of the valley is this place over here, which is a uh, village that has some historical significance. Barry actually knows a whole bunch about it. He'll tell us about it. Barry's coming up right here. And so we're going to walk through the village as they have, how many times have you been here? Probably close to 10 times. Holy moly! Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. I didn't realize you were here always, so many always times. Always an adventure each time we come. Okay, perfect, perfect. So he's letting me join the adventure this time. Yep. And this is Barry. Hey. <laughs> Let's go. Let's, Let's go. go. Yeah, anybody has to go to the bathroom, do it now. There's a toilet for you. Uh, actually, there are toilets in here, but not so working. What do you call it? Yellow wine? <laughs> Yellow wine? Eee. It's where you want Huang to breathe, breathe through your mouth. Huangzhou. Actually, it's beautiful though. I could fly the drone, but we are actually in the flight path from uh, uh, Lisha Airport, so uh, there's no flying of the drones here. So everything is going to be. You'll hear the planes from coming here. over too. I mean, even just this road right here is beautiful. So I saw I came through here with my bike two weeks ago, maybe, and there's a lady sweeping the sidewalks here. This this village is half demolished, probably three quarters demolished. She's sweeping the sidewalks because people still live here. Huh. So that's dedication that the people that live here want to take care of the place. So originally, uh, before its relocation, basically there are around like 1,400 locals yeah. and 3,000 migrant workers. <gasps> wow. So like so 4,500. 4, yeah, something like that. And now how many people are living here? 60. <laughs> 60. <laughs> labels of the, the place very interesting because they tells you what's the location of the the, the house so they're using, yeah, yeah middle front so okay. they're using the word to give you the location of the house and this is the fun part is walking into the yeah house yeah to kind of you know some people left some stuff you know some toys and furniture think of the stories that you know kids were born here people loved Somebody left uh, kids' artwork on the wall. Oh. We took one photo. Yeah, we took a photo of this, yes. yeah. Huh. But, you know, you can That's kind of some, feel... Uh, the lotus root, right? You some can lotus, feel the ghosts in these places. Yeah. That, you know, this was somebody's house, and they, they left some stuff, and they took the rest. But you, can, you feel the humanity and the carcass of the building. I wonder, like, if you have kids here, there's got to be a point on the wall where you mark their height. <laughs> you know, the lines? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Billy, Billy, is that a they, they do that in the U.S. a lot. I know, but... Oh, they do that here a lot. Oh, do they? Really? Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. What was the date? 2015? Yeah. You said that's when they started, right? Started the relocation oh, process. So they probably left 2015. Oh. Oh, wow. Yeah, it has been. Look at this person was learning some English. Oh. Eats it? Chair? What's that? Wow, <laughs> Ooh, abacus. Balsam pear. Here you can understand that. Like, uh, what, what's a balsam pear? These are actually some cool souvenirs. Balsam pear. Kugua, bitter yeah, yeah, melon. Yeah, bitter melon. Yeah. I could use these to learn Yeah, yeah, yeah let's, let's <laughs> steal them. Let's put them in a my camera bag, take them with. Xing, xing. Heart get shape. a gift of the day. This could actually be some artwork, too. Yeah. You can glue these to something. Cool. Huh. Wow.
some of these houses have a little narrative too that we'll get to when we get there. I mean, think about it. You've got mahjong tiles. You got the kids. You got yeah. a little Swiffer. Yeah, <laughs> a little yeah. Swiffer. Yeah, yeah. And then you had the stairs here. So somebody, somebody used yeah. either lived up in the attic or that's where they stored some stuff. Huh. Dried the vegetables up there. And you have a, a big old water cistern. Cistern. That's a word that I had wanted to use on multiple occasions, but just didn't have it. Now, I'm, now, now I have it. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you, Jim. Another plane flying over. So to be honest, this is not the interesting stuff here. Yeah, yeah. This this is, is, we're just getting this, into it. This is more contemporary. I, I wouldn't mind coming here and actually doing like a, a more solid documentary where I'm taking time to really, really uh, capture moments. And because of the name of the village, Shi Jia Cun, Shi is actually a big name. Yeah. So their ancestors can trace all the way back to the beginning of Song Dynasty. Wow. Because Shi Shou Kai was the very famous general that supported uh, Zhao Kuangying to become the first emperor, the majest uh, majesties of Song Dynasty. Mm -hmm. What did you do? Um, obviously, you've been doing some research. Did you? Did you go to the library? You went online? You were just trying to... There's a webpage. There's a web page. I, I, on Baidu, and I think if you go to the archive, you'll find much more information there. Can you share with me that link? And then I, I can kind of put it in the video? That would be cool. Right here. Washing dishes, doing laundry, fishing. A bank of the water looks pretty nasty, though. What a beautiful reflection, though. Oh, my God. I love that. I love that. Yeah. And if you scan the QR code, you will find a surprise. Yeah. <laughs> it's going to say exactly what the plaque says. Oh, really? <laughs> you would think there's some in depth page that gives you the whole thing. No. It's just it's the same information as the plaque. Well, that's a good idea. And this is like honestly nothing really special. This is just another village with a with a history behind it. Yeah. One of millions, you know. That's standing in the way of the bulldozer yeah. plow. Like the future right yeah. across the river. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then the future's over there. God, I wish I could fly the drone. It would be an interesting would be very cool. juxtaposition to see yeah. the the two different sides via air from above. I mean, somebody had to think about doing their stairs like this. Look at the walls, they all ripped out the top of the wires. <laughs> yeah. Hardwood floors up here. This was a nice house. Yeah. I went to a house once, where was I, in Guangzhou? The kids in their house, they invited me for dinner. They did this to the entire house. Like, this is the kids' room probably, but they did this to the entire house. Canvas. Just scribbles everywhere. One plus one plus one equals three. Well, this one's wrong. One times one <laughs> equals 32. <laughs> we'll load up the film here. Yeah. Careful, there's nails coming up from the boards. Truly, out with the old and in with the new. I just love thinking about like these places and the lives spent here. Me in? No, that's... Oh, uh, what are they doing here? Yeah, what they're doing a like chem lab work. <laughs> Real lab work? But it's like powder, flour. Oh. Yojing? I don't understand what that means. <laughs> but milk, oil. Okay. Imagine you can do a podcast this way. Yeah. Story of Shi Jia Village. Yeah. And today we are going to number one. <laughs> 68 today. I mean, yeah. somebody's farming here too. I mean, you know. Yeah, the people that are still here are still yeah. farming. Whatever little plot there is. 
and ferry it's people ferry. across. Yeah, it looks like it might have been a ferry. <laughs> ferry across the river. Yeah, there's no real bridge here, so I guess that's the way you're getting across. Now this used to be a school, and there's a marker here, primary school. And now it's a casting factory. Old site of the Tung Yi Primary School. Oh, okay. Casting for sure. Casting, yeah. Got lead? Yeah. 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 Lead. Must be. Uh, zinc, probably. Zinc? Zinc alloy. Ah, okay. Usually die casting is either aluminum or zinc alloy. Yeah. That's my life. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Why don't we go into the, yeah. the village now? I wonder if he's got approval to set up a shop in there or if he just did. There are a lot of cameras here in this yeah. village, yeah. so somebody's monitoring what's going on here. ハニハ。ハニハ。ハニハ。ハニハ。ハニハ。ハニハ。ハニハ。ハニハ。ハニハ。ハニハ。ハニハ。ハニハ。ハニハ。ハニハ。ハニハ。ハニハ。ハニハ
It's an upgrade. There are a lot of buildings in the village that have this courtyard treatment where oh, families oh, yeah. live together. The courtyards are just, you know, overrun. The trees are overgrown. Yeah, but this was quite a community, eh? So you had all of these structures, all of these buildings. Do you think all of these were residences, or you probably had all sorts of different things going on in these? Oh, wow, and they're interconnected, too. Yeah. Box spring, that looks comfortable. Free Airbnb tonight. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, you know, I used to set up tents on places like this when I was traveling. Oh, some chicken. That's kind of nice structure. Stinks here though. Somebody's been using this area as a toilet. You see this community way off, like living together. Yeah. That the kids basically have that playground and they can entertain with each other. There's only gonna be one person sitting next to each other, like supervising kids. Yeah. But the rest of the family can just do the field work, do the yeah. other stuff. So yeah. And yeah. right now it's one parent, one kid sitting outside the tutoring <laughs> institutions, you know. Yeah, yeah. But back then it was truly community, like yes. a real community. Yes. With Chinese traditional value. Later on we're gonna see something. Oh, it's right over there. So on top of the the, oh, the character, the character luck, longevity, or some like motivation thing, like you can look at and say, "Oh, luck is ahead of me," you know. Huh. You could spend a, a lot of time here, man. The hmm. dog vaccine house is this way. Dog vaccine. Yeah. Look, when we first found it, it looked like a shooting gallery in Detroit. I mean, mm -hmm. it was full of vials of <laughs> of drugs, and oh. hypodermic needles. So it's a veterinary clinic or something. No, I think people were just getting inoculated here oh. in case they got uh, bit by a dog. Oh, so like rabies. rabies. Yeah. Yeah, J J Jim and Barry have been here so many times that they have like, they have a map and it's all plotted out different like interesting places. I always find these interesting. These are like little reservoirs off the main river. They have these reservoirs that'll come out and then people use this water here to you know, irrigate or wash clothes or whatever, but it's offshoot of the main river. Let's let's head over to the barber and then we'll come back. Barber, okay. Hey, hey, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, 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 yeah. Farmer? <laughs> So veggies got over ripen uh, for the chickens. Oh. The veggies, veggies get what? They're overripe. So over he's going to feed them uh, to the chickens. Oh, uh, uh, okay. <laughs> he's going to pick the, the best part for a dish tonight. Yeah. The rest for the, for the chickens. Yeah. Yeah. Somebody with a hoe. You can hear the uh, sounds of traffic because right over here is the main highway. One of the main highways that cuts across Ningbo. It's kind of wild to walk through such a dilapidated place. If, if you took the sound of the road and the few remnants of people, this place would be like the suitable location for an apocalyptic scene in a movie. Post-apocalyptic. This is the barber shop, and I climbed up on top of this pile of rubble and got a great shot of him looking down a portrait. Yeah. I just killed it on Instagram. I don't know. It was a, it was a <laughs> good, simple good. portrait, but everybody loved it. If you guys don't know Jim, Jim's a uh, Instagram celebrity. 
I'll leave his link to his Instagram in the in the description. I love telling a story. I love telling a story. Yeah, it doesn't take much. No. No, they're talking about the location of the ancestral temple. Oh, oh. Because I was trying to locate it, and yeah. they were telling a, they were telling a lot of stories, okay. uh, like in the past and whatever. Oh, yeah. 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 And they all have the same last name, Shu. Shu. So. It's too dark. Yeah, I know. It's a good shot looking the other way. Let's, let's go and say, hey, Nia. Oh, during <laughs> Chinese New Year. Oh, it's did not travel. Okay. Didn't travel at all. So. Mm. <laughs> Too tired to walk around. How long has he lived here? Since he was a child, or yes? How long? How long? Is he? Do you know that the... Seventy years. Yeah. Li <laughs> And his barber sings. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Your goat, your goat's name is what? I don't know. I don't know. Little goat. Little goat. One old dog. Homeless dog. Homeless dog. Yeah. Try to demolish the village. And right now, there's nothing more to demolish other than some cultural ruins. So later on, what they're gonna do is trying to renovate some parts and make it like, like a fancy Mantang Old Street. Okay, that's the, in the proposal. Oh, but uh, you, you never know when it's gonna happen. It's yeah. on the paper. And and look, look around too. And there's not much left. Yeah. Well, I'm I'm pointing at the built the tall buildings, the apartment mm -hmm. buildings. They're surrounded by apartment buildings. Mm -hmm. Now maybe this will become a cultural center, but maybe it'll become more apartment buildings too. There's a lot of questions that need to be answered on how this place is going to move forward. Holy moly, chickens! You guys see this? There they are. Second floor dog. Oh. Oh yeah, those aren't those aren't pet dogs. Yeah, I think in the second floor of that building is uh, dogs being raised for food. Maybe, not 100% sure, but there's a lot of dogs in that building. You're trying to find the. Uh, oh, some needles. Are you getting close? I guess. So that'll ruin the door, maybe. Oh, needles. Yeah. Then somebody sealed the door. Hi. Ha do HP5? HP5. Okay. E. R. San. 
。好、哦，谢谢谢谢。我阿拉今朝来搿场里头哦，我还来了，等脚下打来。嗯好，好。来来来。That is well worn. He's been studying that for a long time. 少年了，我也年老的。啊，平常时就干旧事。所以每年都是你，我你吧，啊，你不每年活动会用过啊？也吧，啊，过年你是聚会，你是聚会啦？那肯定还做新闻领导不啦？新闻领导吧？新新闻领导没？啊。出去，出去啊！按照自苗语不啦？哎，我有。呃，肯定村里头自苗语不啦？爸爸。有，现在有新闻网没有？啊。新闻新闻新闻没有？啊。现在没有。出出出出掉了。出出没出掉，挖里的。还挖里的？菩萨就不补掉了。哎，没出掉。菩萨补掉了不啦 ？The whole history of the village is trapped within this this guy. Bye bye. I was asking him about the. Like, because he is reading some Buddhist scripture, right? Yeah. I asked him, how long have you been practicing, practicing this Buddhism? He said, many years. But then I asked him, where is the, the temple in the village? And he said, it's still there, but people might just take away the Buddha statues uh, or whatever. Yeah. Relocate it somewhere shop. else. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. But uh, the other side of the village, there's a, there's a small temple for the local guardian, Tu Di Gong. Oh. Is that where we park? Yeah, we yeah, park. Yeah, where we so park we gotta park, check yeah. out that yeah. later. So you can see in every Chinese in, uh, village, instead of the Western style with a church in the middle, yeah, we have uh, ancestral Buddhist. temple, ancestral and, temple, and some Buddhist temple for the Buddhist practitioners. Huh. So that's our Chinese way of living, I guess. Mm -hmm. Looks like it was fairly li recently taken down. It's still now pretty. Now we've gone down that path. Yeah. We've gone down this path, but we haven't. Yeah, that. I even like the the green, just mm -hmm. popping out amidst the rubble. Mm. Nature will eventually yeah prevail. overtake. Yeah, that's beautiful. These are all basically small roof tiles that are laid on top of each other. There's a museum in Ningbo, the Ningbo Museum in Yinzhou. And the walls are made out of like a bunch of parts from these old villages they are like reclaimed. <laughs> I didn't realize that what I'm standing next to right now is a, it's a doorway, a doorway to nothing. What's this say? Right? No, that's not sure. Uh, Hello, friends. Hello. If you want to eat stuff, grow your own food. Don't steal other people. Oh, oh that's interesting. Don't be bad guys. Correct yourself. If you don't correct yourself, I'm being serious. <laughs> it says I'm being serious? Yeah. This is I'm being serious. Junda. Uh, Jun. I know who steals. Oh! <laughs> it's like the refrigerator. I know who took my lunch yesterday. You better not take it again, you bastard. Oh, this one. What does this one say? Hey, hey, hey friends. What does it say? The God is watching. I know who steals. Please cooperate. Oh, so it says the same thing as the other one. Wow, somebody's pissed. <laughs> like sexual transmitted disease. Oh, is that what that is? Yeah. What does it say? Beware, don't, don't. We can make sure we cure your disease. Oh, this place inside, or that number. Ads. And then they have WeChat number usually and with a phone number. Sexual. And so if you got, if you got herpes or something, you could call that number? I don't even remember this part. Right? We came back but this, this one time. But not in the past two times. Not, I, don't I don't remember. This is just kind of groovy. Yeah. The it's boat beautiful. just sitting here. The people that lived their lives here. I mean, before this place started to become slated for uh, destruction, the people that lived their lives here never considered even 
probably conceived of the thought of this place being so dilapidated. It was home. It was, <laughs> it wasn't this. That place was clean, you know, or, or as clean as it is in the village. It was a place for family, for food, for friendship, and all sorts of other F words that I can't quite think of right now. Hello. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> but today it's just a, it's just a slowly degrading place. Slowly being reclaimed by nature, slowly being planned over for future buildings, future structures. Oh, that's neat. <laughs> I mean, think about that door. Somebody had to really, really think about that door. You looked around this place, there's no doors like that. So whoever built that door was thinking, my place is going to be special. These are the front end of his business or the front end of his house. It was something that they prided themselves on. They thought about it. They planned it. They sat around with their buddies and said, I want to make a door better than everybody else's door. <laughs> Pretty soon that door is going to be demolished. Yeah, and they're either called moon gates or they're called keyhole doors. Mm. They're kind of in the shape right, of Right, right, right. The bottom is yeah. sort of straight. Yeah, we're coming in the same way you did. Quiet here. Oh, well, that's the stairway up to the heaven place. Stairway to heaven? Sort of. I don't want to see this. The last book to that is here. Every time a muff should be this place. Yeah, this will be the third time we've come up here. Okay. The chances of finding this were astronomical, but since then, we've been like a 12 year old boy. You gotta go back? We gave it. like our male chromosomes who led us to this place. Uh-oh. I think they took some images away. Really? No. no oh. Like <laughs> so these are all YouTube safe because someone scratched out all the images. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's whoever funny. Whoever lived here had a real penchant for girly photos. Wow. And plastered the walls. You know what? This is exactly the same. I think so. That book that we that found. book. We found a book at the flea market that was just like Let's this. Figure this out. 1970s yeah. Playboy images. No way. Huh? Another guy was looking at the book. He says, "Oh, this is art." Oh yeah. The copper wire. So <laughs> next time you know where to find the book. <laughs> oh. So this is the same book. Because a woman stands Shui, for water. Shui jige. The song of water. Oh, Shui jige. Because in Chinese we say we may all made hey, of water. So. You know what? We're all wired the same. We're all kind of like looking for that one thing that, you know. For this guy, it was these girls on the wall. I just, <laughs> nobody touch anything. Where's the black light? <laughs> Where's the black light? This you don't know what the ceiling because the ceiling's not here anymore. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here's another little courtyard. Oh, look, a little uh, uh, a oh, rice grinding stone. grinding stone. Yeah, it's almost as if we're peeping toms to the village itself. We're looking under the village's skirt. You can see so much about the people who lived here, but you can't see the people that lived here. Everything except that. Pretty crazy. Look at this place. This is a, a fairly nice house for for this village. Probably had a big screen TV there. How much passion was invested here? Dreams, hopes, kids going to school, coming home, studying. Crazy. What is that? Goji berry? Goji, Goji berry, shiitake yeah. mushroom bags. Yeah. 
Oh, hello. Yeah. Playing video games? Yeah. <laughs> that was old and new right there, eh? Those kids were walking through, playing their, playing their connected phones. Yeah, they're playing Wi-Fi video games. Yeah, they're walking through playing Wi-Fi video games. Yeah, they're walking through playing their connected phones. Wi-Fi video games. Meanwhile, in the old village. Dog fighting pigs. Huh? They can jump over the building. I wish I could just take all the dogs somewhere safe. Where else? There's no way those guys live here. Uh, Although, why else would they be here? Way above. Just about. hanging out? Because they like this piece of ambiance. I was like, I'm going to go to the house. 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 你们你们多少年前是来这里是来玩是可以玩的？哦，有多少年前？啊，四年有了吧 ？OK， four years. Four years ago they came here for fun and it was fun here. Yeah. And nowadays after four years they revisit here. That was a reunion. Okay. Okay. Oh, this is what the dog eat, huh? Oh, thank you. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Yeah. Okay, they'll get a kick out of that. <laughs> no, I told them Matt has a, a Bili Bili B genre. Okay. And he was like, oh, you. No, no. I bet this corner, this corner was the coolest corner in town. Private, right along the river. Get a little bench here. Is it a through way? There's a bridge over there. Oh, but you can't get to it? Yes, we can, but we're gonna walk a bit over there. Oh, I mean this way though. Uh, this way? Uh, no. So across the bridge, we've never gone over there. I mean, we, I've ridden my bike, but we've never explored this area. So this is uncharted territory. We're off the grid at this point. That's right. We're off the grid. China Unicom. <laughs> you suck, China Unicom. Yeah. China Mobile kicks your ass. Really? Crazy. There's like an industrialized ring. There's like a ring around all these major cities in, in China. And it's pushing outward. You know, a developmental ring. Inside the center, you got the like city center, the biggest buildings downtown. And then as the factories go down as the villages go down and then these residential apartment complexes get built you have this outer edge like like in a like in a, a nuclear explosion when the wind edge blows everything down and then it gets remade and burned and recreated these guys were drinking oh somebody was having a good time that was the going away party i think yeah some mo tai We're walking through the, uh, you know, the debris field on the edge of that, that explosion. I'm not sure I want to say it out loud, but we haven't seen any rats yet. <laughs> Do you normally? I said it out loud. Do you normally? No, never. Okay, okay. Never. But don't you think this would be a, a, a infested? Land? Infested? Yeah. yeah. We set out poison. If in, uh, if in 10 years or so, 20 years, this place becomes uh, the cool, niche, hip, hipster mecca, coffee shops and all sorts of interesting places, this video will be an interesting catalog of the final breaths of this, uh, of this area. I think that you can see the way that they're building around it and they haven't really attacked this area with regards to development yet. They're just kind of sitting on it. I'm wondering if they're going to make this sort of... In China they have an area called Nantan Laojia, 
Um, and as a matter of fact, yesterday uh, I went to a re rebuilt village. You know, they, they, you could raise most of this, uh, most of these structures, and leave some of the more unique ones, and then rebuild them, and then build the entire area up. I'd be curious to see if they did it, and if they did, holy moly, this video would be very interesting to look back on. Yeah, geez, what a view. What it, where's the meat in this in this wall? There's no they're just literally just flat pieces. Like so that must be hollow. You would think when you look at it from the outside that there's a brick. Yeah. But these aren't bricks, these are the whole Very thing is made up of uh it's faster to make a thin brick than a thick brick. Huh. Yeah, I always thought those were stones. Yeah. Oh, that makes me wonder if any of this stuff is solid. I think the house doesn't need to be that complicated, but if you build a city wall, that's yeah. usually... Yeah, it's load-bearing. Yeah. These aren't load-bearing. Yeah. Yeah. And that probably affords a certain level of insulation, too. Yeah. I mean, the air is... Some bamboo here. Watch your step. Looks like somebody was doing some painting. <laughs> I don't know if this is this is art or somebody was actually painting for a project. Oh, can't walk on this. That's interesting. So this is all a deck over the river. Look at that pot. That is a beautiful pot. Huh? The village suburbs. Well, I mean, this whole porch here over the river, this this like this like uh, look at that big urn over there. Yeah, yeah, it's beautiful. It's pretty cool. But it's I mean, all. That would be worth rescuing. For somebody, not for me. <laughs> yeah, that's gotta be worth something yeah. to somebody. Yeah, that's why I'm like, I'm not thinking that that painting was for art. Maybe it was just they were using this place as a. As a yeah, something. Yeah. What is up there? Oh, it's just an oven. They could fire things here. You know what? Maybe they were doing pottery here. Maybe that's a kiln. Advertisement material. Advertisement oh, maybe they're material. making billboards or something. Yeah, yeah, for sure. These are all These might be that. stencils. Yeah. yeah, that's what they were doing. I wonder what provoked somebody to punch a door right there. <laughs> I think that one needs to do Well, somebody got their artistic flair here. Yeah. <sighs> Careful of the giraffe. Don't get too close to the giraffe. Ah. Oh my god. That is portrait work. <laughs> 
Oh, oh. oh guys, got Wow, the fancy cars here. Well, the wet market's right over here. We're okay, are we, oh, we're back. Okay. Yeah, we're back on the main drive yeah, yeah. here. You'll recognize it as a wet market with these big slabs. Oh, okay. Meat, vegetables. Look at the electrical, electrical cabling that yeah. would go around. That's wild. So this was a wet market. This is where you'd buy, buy and sell. Village, village grocery store. What's going on in that bathroom? Advertising. <laughs> Advertising. Pinch the nose. Yeah. What's it say? Extension and thicken with in a violent way. <laughs> and here is a famous Japanese uh, porn star. And this is a guy is famous for his middle finger. <laughs> really? Yes. The woman said he has a bad middle finger to get women high. <laughs> the bathrooms improved a considerable amount, but it used to be that if you wanted to go number two, you'd go in one of these stalls that was completely open. There's no door, there's no hiding, and you actually go into a trough. I've, 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 I've had to go to the bathroom in many of strange bathroom in China. <laughs> Crazy. Some costumes. There's a maybe from the amusement park actually. Everywhere here is a she's house. Shi. 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 Times of the Republic of China. So it's not that old. Kind of reminds me of uh, uh, Fukushima. I went. We, I went into the back areas of Fukushima, the abandoned areas. Hemei. That's the name of this village, right? Uh, no. Shijiazhu. Shijiazhu. Hemei is the, the propaganda they put here. Oh. The harmony, families. <laughs> the same lady or the same lady? Yes, the same lady. 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 The same so they grow much faster than humans for sure. <laughs> and then she said the dog came to her field and destroyed some veggies. Yeah. She had to take some home, otherwise those dogs those eat it yeah. So yeah. they're so now they just vegetarian dogs. Yeah. Who would have thought? Somebody needs to come in there and, and uh, take all their balls off or something. <laughs> <laughs> That's so kinda weird. So dog. she said that the dogs were relocated to that building because they were strays and she doesn't know what to do with them. So either they're growing them to eat or they're just letting them reproduce in that, in that building. Don't know for sure. I'm leaning towards the, them, them eating them, <laughs> but maybe not, maybe not. Oh, these are the public showers. Public yes, showers. but when the, when the hot water is steaming scarcity, that's what you do, you know, commune style. Oh. 
Bring the whole family in and turn and it on. And get your favorite ice cream on the way back. Yeah. Yeah. So it's a, you get an ice cream stop? Yes, sir. Oh, pack. this is an ice cream store. Oh, okay. So you come here, you take a shower, and you get an ice cream. Is this a well? That must be one of the wells here. Cap well. The community community showers. My house doesn't have a shower. I just go to the community shower every time I want to take a shower. Chayo. They're just using the tombstones as walls. Yes, and Guangxi was emperor for the reform. Yeah. It's actually at the same time as uh, the uh, Mingji restoration in mm. Japan. Mm. So, 150 years ago. Opium won't hear it. All right, well that was interesting. Thanks, Barry. Welcome. For being our guide. Thanks, Jim, for introducing it. Being our guide as well. <laughs> And uh, yeah, yeah, there's all, all sorts of little villages like this all over China in transition from populated to raised to the ground to apartment building. Very, this is kind of a special to actually see one that's so close to being really is. done, you know. And I think some people still have high hopes that they're going to resurrect this as yeah. a historical place, but only partially at best. Maybe a few buildings. Check the description. I, I, there's a few times me and uh, me and Jim here have gone to other villages and, and, and checked things out. I'll leave links to those in the in the section below. Take it easy, Chayo. Have a Patreon. Join that if you want some interesting special info there. Hit a like, subscribe, share, comment. Be nice, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.